Q&A, 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 Q&A today, what's up, what's up, what's up, let me see who's all on here, look a real nigga in his eyes, stop looking around, stop looking scary, ask your question, Q&A, Q&A, what's up, what's up, Q&A. Hold on, I had to make I, I had to make sure I saw that right. This nigga from New Jersey said I'm worrying about why I'm texting this female. Nigga, I'm not texting your female. I'm not worried about your chick, man. You heard me. If anything, they worried about me. They want a hard-working young man. They don't want nobody that's sitting in the house. They up under you 24-7. You heard me? They don't want that. Q&A, next one. Pass. You blocked. Because I'm definitely ain't worried about your girl, man. I got too much money out here. Too many opportunities. Too many goals. You heard me? Too many blessings. I'm not worried about your female. If I wanted her, I'll take her. You better ask about me. And you won't get her back. Q&A, Q&A. Y'all better hurry up. I'm about to get up off of here. Yeah, man. I know your girl, too. Her pussy smell like old-ass chitlins. You could put that motherfucker in a fishbowl. The dog won't even drink it. Your chihuahua won't even drink that. Her pussy's out of date, man. For you to think I really want your female, you was out of date also. Matter of fact, you expired. That's why you blocked. You expired. Yeah, eighth project on the way. Q&A, Q&A. Yeah, we still doing shows. I'm still in the city. If that bag is there, I'm there. Best believe it. Q&A, Q&A, what's up, what's up? That nigga little boosies on here. Hey, man, when we gonna do a project, man? Quit playing with the young stepper. When we gonna do a project, man? I'm ready to fuck it up for real. I know you ain't them type that got a life but not a purpose. Ooh, they saying little boosie got a life but not a, pers a purpose. Who else? They saying NBA young boy got a life and not a purpose. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I can't agree with that. I ain't gonna make no comment. Who said that? Somebody from California saying all these rappers sound the same. They say the same thing, just in a different standard, a different form. They ain't really living that life. Oh. I ain't gonna comment on that. Like I said, some rappers, some athletes. I'ma let them comment on that. Q and A, Q and A, what's up? They asked him when I'ma come to Nigeria. When that bag is up, I don't step out the door if it's not about no money. I don't like making excuses. I have bills to pay. Niece and nephew, you feel me, got someone to look up to. Seven-year-old and eight-year-old niece and nephew got someone to look up to. Fans and them, I got fans and them to support. That band through the same struggle. You heard me? When that bag is up, best believe I'll be there. Because I do not make no excuses. What do you say? Oh, I just missed that one. Q and A, Q and A, Q and A. Yeah. Period. You right on point. You right on the noggin. They are distracted by the internet. Everybody talk about the struggle, 
and everybody talk about trying to make a change. The struggle is right now. People don't have food. People don't got places to go. You heard me? I want to ask you this. Where are the people that have a life and a purpose at on my life? Yeah, that's my Q&A. Where are the people that have a life and a purpose? There's too many people out here that have a life but no purpose. There's challenges every day. Yeah, for example, Tupac, you said it. Tupac, Biggie, Kobe Bryant, Martin Luther King. They all had a life and a purpose. But everybody want a handout. Most people want a handout. I ain't saying you. I ain't saying you. They know who I'm talking to. Yeah. Chicago. They're like, steppers in Chicago have a life and, and purpose. Some of them. Steppers in California have a life and purpose. Some of them. What'd she say? I just missed that one. I'm gonna come back to you, little shorty. Where are the people that have a life and a purpose and it can accept the challenge because I'm always in the city money is 24-7 you heard me you gotta go out there and get it period if you can work from home money is out there if you got all 10 fingers 10 toes a head on your shoulder you got a nose eyes I don't care how old you is money is still out there your purpose is still out there your career is still on the line. There's always somebody watching you. Facts. They took books away. It says what's going on. What exactly going on right now? You hear me? You heard me? If it's your time to go, it's your time to go. You could sit in the house for goddamn years. That can't save you. You heard me. If it's your time to go, it's your time to go. Stop trying to blame the virus. If it's your time to go, it's your time to go, man. Salute, salute, salute. People that hit the subscribe button, put that thumbs up. Thanks for all the donations. Yes, description is below. You can follow my Instagram. Yes, yes, yes. Salute to all my real fans and my supporters that been following my Instagram. Like I said, Eighth Project is on the countdown. You got all these young niggas and females out here, you feel me, that was begging for a change, begging for help. Let me start off by saying first, begging for a change. Okay, you begging for a change. You, you have a life, right? Everybody have a life, no matter who you is. You could be a goddamn dog, you heard me, kangaroo. You could be a goddamn cereal box with legs. You heard me? You have a life. Everybody have a life. But the thing is, everybody don't have a purpose. You feel me? Challenges us every day. First, we was paying attention to Chicago killers. And salute to all my Chicago shooters out there. Yes, I'm coming to your city to perform pretty soon. Just wait on that. But yeah, we was all talking about the Chicago killers. Now we're talking about the coronavirus killers. That's the only thing everybody know now. I remember once upon a time, the Chicago's killings was making the news everywhere. Now look, it switched up. The coronavirus is making the news everywhere. But still, too many people waiting on the handout, hoping. They waiting on the handout, hoping something comes your way. You feel me? There's something out there for each and everybody. 
but people are just too lazy. They don't want nothing. You heard me? They wanted to walk. You feel me? It just like um, Frosty the Snowman. You want him to walk to your house and deliver you a new car and a new house and probably a new wig. But you ain't working for it. Only thing you doing at the house is eating pop tarts, eating all goddamn day. You don't got no money put up. You ain't stepping on nothing. But then you, you so quick to put something on paper and go in the studio. You heard me? But you ain't living that life. You heard me? For you to talk about the struggle, you actually got to be in the struggle. Try to make a change in the struggle. Some kind of way, shape, or form. You got to use your head. A lot of people got head on here. Just like Unk just said. What's up, Unk? Yeah, man. A lot of people got a head that be watching my lives. And salute to all my fans. You heard me? You rock with me through the bad and good. Like I said, you feel me? We been in the struggle. I've been talking about the struggle since 13. You heard me? That's the only thing I know is to speak up for the streets. And say fuck the cops and anybody that fucks with the cops. Or Trump. Or anybody that wants smoke. That bag is up. I ain't gonna stop grinding. You heard me? I ain't gonna stop working. I'ma always have a backup plan. You feel me? Cause too many people wanna see you fall. You just, just look and think about it. Have you heard that phrase, who wants to be a leader? I could tell you right now, the internet is a leader. You feel me? But it's a bad leader. It could be a good leader, just like you, her, or them. They could be a good leader, but the internet is a bad leader. You feel me? This is not God's plan to put fear in your heart, they heart. None of that. This is not God's plan. You feel me? God knows when you finna go and how you finna go. Everybody's dying in thousands. You feel me? Thousands and thousands of people dying in one day, two days, a week, a month. That's not God's plan, man. Y'all gotta wake up. You heard me? You scaring yourself, pretty much. You giving yourself the own virus. You think you can sit in the house for 14 days and a month to hide death? To clear death away from you? To get away from death? You is a lie. The internet can, don't control when you die. You heard me? When it's time for you to go, it's time for you to go. But the main thing is... When you was here on earth, because like I said, nobody's promised. Anybody can leave. Anytime. You're not promised. But the only thing is, do you have a life and a purpose, or do you just have a life? Everybody have a life. But do you have a purpose for your life? Or you want to continue to, you don't want to be a leader for yourself and your family and your kids and your niece and nephew. You want to be a leader for the internet Because the internet is a leader It gets millions of people scared Fear Death Anxious And it sucks man But that's not Only thing I'm trying to say at the end of this video I'm going to stay working Like I said I was dropping music Before the coronavirus I was in the streets speaking up for the streets before the coronavirus, I was going through the struggle before the coronavirus, before any virus. When I came out of my mama's hooligan pussy, yeah, she had me, she was a hooligan through the border and back. Her titty was floating, floating her ass through the border. You heard me? Her titty flied her ass to the border. Yeah, right across that motherfucking wall, under the mud. Yeah, that's how you know real West Side Thug, for real. We out here like that. But, like I said, no procrastination. We gonna stay working. We stay stepping like that. We been ready for war, you heard me? For smoke. You heard me? But where is all the real street niggas at? Through the struggling times. Black women. Black dads, brothers, sisters, nieces, and nephews. 
Y'all always in the streets. Y'all always trying to speak up for the streets, trying to put food on the table. But I see most of y'all. Yes, we all see most of y'all, you feel me? Y'all not really living like that. Y'all write stuff on pen and paper, making it sound good. It gotta sound good. Where's the challenges are at? You feel me? Entertainment is about challenges. Where are the challenges at? Because when I said this eighth project, we coming with force for anybody. Hop off my live with that 6 9 BS, man. You feel me? Because 6 9 is at the top of the list. And I'm just saying facts. You heard me? I'm at his head every fucking angle. For real. I do not support a rat. I do not support fake. I do not support pussy. Every angle at that nigga 6 9's head I'm at. You feel me? And it's up from there. I ain't finna argue with the nigga on internet. You heard me? Get caught by the police. Like I said, miserable love company. So, you feel me? If he want his company, he will definitely get his company. Because, I mean, a drop ain't nothing but a number. I'm sorry. A drop is nothing but a number. So, I mean, like I said, like she said, salute. Thanks for the subscriber. Thanks for putting your thumbs up, little mama. You heard my seed. But anyway, a drop ain't nothing but a number. So, I mean, stop mentioning 6 9 on my live. You heard me? I don't support pussy. I don't support handouts. I only support the real. I only support the real. I only su support the streets. 6 9 is a illegal fed. He's a illegal fed. They talk about illegal immigrants. That nigga is a illegal fed. <laughs> yeah, man. They talk about illegal immigrants. That nigga 6 9 is a illegal fed. Fuck it. And I won't smoke a legal rat. Because it's really like that. It's really like that. I can't support that. I got to keep it real with you. I can't support it. I can't support the fuckery. Period.